Hey everybody, it's Brad. And I'm Krista. Oh, yeah, it was a big family homestead. End of a, a long day. So usually what happens is we end up filming this front part at the end of the day. Yes. Usually. Yes. Because we know what happened. Right. And so I'm still in my barn clothes and smelly. It was funny. It's like I started wearing button-up shirts, okay, I think, the day we started making YouTube videos. No, not right away. It was not right away. It was it was a couple of years in, I think. Because I've looked back at some of our older videos. and I used to be t-shirts only. T-shirts and shorts and a ball cap. Shorts, ball cap, mm -hmm. no matter what time of the weather right. it was. Time he, of the would, weather. he would wear shorts out in the middle of winter. It's never in Ohio, me. it's not so bad. Up here? Not it still doesn't idea. bother me until it gets below zero. But that's not what this video is about. Below zero. <laughs> Honestly. I know. It's just Honestly. So, okay. Lot to talk about. We got to show you a lot of cool things that are happening on the farm. Animal stuff. Mm -hmm. um, garden stuff. Uh, but before we do, health things for Krista and I. Um, thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you for reaching out. Thank you for making lots of comments, mm -hmm. the, the folks that are being constructive. Uh, some people are just nasty and you gotta block their comment, but it's not, that's anyway. not the majority. Right. That's not the majority, so thank you. Um, that said, we are going to take steps to launch another channel that deals with this stuff. Right. Mainly because... Well, just because it doesn't have anything to do with homesteading. It's uh, it, it's our journey and to get healthy. And so um, we're, we have another channel that is dedicated to that. And there is a video out there already. Uh, it's the same one that you guys saw this morning or well, yesterday, yesterday morning. depending on when you're watching this. Um, but we're going to put up videos... Every day, and oh, right? well, as often as we as can. As often as we can, right? Yeah, because so, life gets in the way, like doctor's appointments and stuff like that. But. Right, and homeschooling and farm stuff and pinata creation day, and so there'll be another channel for that. Yep. And another reason is that we understand that the people that come here for homesteading are going to get irritated after a while. Right, they don't want to see it. <laughs> and I get it. Yeah. I mean. If I go to a guitar channel because I want to watch guitar stuff, I don't want to. I'll, I'll tolerate the people watching, you know, that I'm watching to say, yeah, I'm not feeling really good once in a while. But if it was every time, I might not tune in. So I understand. Same the thing. Guitar channel that starts doing cooking. Yeah, probably not. Not sushi and guitar. So mm -hmm. same Gross. thing. <laughs> so that channel, we've already created it, but I'm going to try to get a link. To put it down below. Yeah. Oh yeah, You'll but it's link. our homestead health. Yep. So some friends of ours said they could they looked for it and they couldn't find it. So hopefully there'll be a link. And we, it was just created this morning, so it's not. I mean, it's not new. It's going to be difficult to find. So. so our homestead health. Yep. Anyway, let's get on to the good homesteading stuff. All right, today is a day that will live. In gardening history. <laughs> Not really. Just repotting stuff. No, yeah. Well, there's a lot of stuff backs up over the winter. Yeah. And we got over there these three things I am really excited about. We've never had success with citrus since we've moved to Wisconsin yeah. at all because you got to keep it inside. Yeah. So, yeah, these are going to get put into pots on the deck. Um, and then in the wintertime, we'll we'll put them in the greenhouse for a bit, and then we'll bring them inside. Right. But this one, isn't that a Meyer lemon? Meyer those, lemon. Those will do good in pots. Key lime, and then... Key lime over there. This is lime. So this is lime, and look at all There's, this new growth. I love it. Oh, wait. Let me see that. Yeah, because when we got them, they weren't, they weren't, the, they weren't sickly looking, but they weren't no. great looking either. No. So the lime... And that's that's the keeper inner liner for Brutus. Yeah, yeah. And let's see. There's the the Meyer. Yeah. Look how big this guy is. Yeah. And then that was the regular key lime over there. Mm -hmm. So you got these size 
These I got on a screaming deal. Boom. Oops, um, no, three dollars and forty-one cents. Oh yeah. Um, they look nice. They're nice. I, I really like them, and um, I'm just repotting some of our house plants, um, just so that they grow and do do well, much what's better. What's the name of that one that you were? It's really cool. It's weird looking, spiky. Uh, this one, one is a Madag Madagascar jewel. Look at that. Yeah, it's really cool. But then they've got these nice leaves that go up yeah, and that great. actually stayed going fine through the winter yeah it's been great i mean it likes it doesn't like the heat of the sun um so that's why this window is really nice um in the winter time i usually have it over on the island during the, the summer time um, but i'm just setting this here until i can figure out a better place for that but, but then, then this one hold on let me let me tell this this the one in between oh this is one that you don't see usually this big north of the mason dixon line boom yeah. <laughs> well yeah. this aloe plant just keeps growing and growing and growing yeah that one's actually got to be repotted but i need to bit have bigger pots um hope uses it for hair masks and face masks and all that healthy beauty stuff um, and we keep it for we keep it for burns um but this this plant we used to keep in uh, a nice sunny window in um in our other house in wisconsin but the second we moved it here it just blew it just went crazy it didn't like too much sun it didn't like too much sun that's what and this is the window i keep it in constantly it gives the perfect amount of light and it it loves it there's so many babies on it i i don't know what to do i yeah so it's good for your digestion too by the it way it's excellent for digestion yeah now this little little guy who's this little guy over here that little guy is a chinese money plant um and i just put it in a bigger pot so that it can grow and i've staked it so that it will stand up straight um and i'm gonna actually have to tie it to the to the stick and so that way it goes straight as opposed to all kinds of twirly twirly wonkiness gumdrops yeah so. Yeah. So does it grow actual money? Because we will be the most in-demand house on our block. Be nice, but no. All right. No, it just the co the the leaves look like coins. So. All right. Let me take you outside and show you what we just got going, Caleb and I. All righty then. So now in our green stock, vertical gardening gardens, we've got one here, got another one over there, and these things are awesome. They um they have seven buckets per level, and then these ones have I forget even one two three four five levels, and what you do is you water from the top. I mean initially you water them all down, but then you water and then it all just makes it it dribbles it all down to each level, and um, that way you can get a lot of growing area in a very very tight space. So for people like uh, apartment dweller folk this oh there she is all right uh what's night oh here i was just gonna try to turn this mom she's just for an example you can go you back get out of the way <laughs> they got, you can get them on those wheels like that or a uh what do they call that a lazy susan and then um what we have here is this is all lettuces. These are all going to be lettuces. That's all going to be lettuces except for I've got two layers of bok choy, which is great. And then we've got like a Lily's lettuce blend over here. And uh, Krista's going to be using, I think, one of these for those lemons or limes. I don't know exactly which one she's using for. But, um, yeah, so we'll be able to show you how these things do. But they grow great. We love them. And um, this will be like a third year with them. And, and they're not messing around in the, in the sun. They're not cracking. There'll be a link in the description if you want to look out for them more. Come on, Chuck. Here comes a chicken. And there's Chuck. Oh, he went the wrong way. So something new has happened. This one, everybody's doing great. Everybody's doing great. So great, in fact, that we decided to go ahead and put this little guy, where is he? He's over there, you see his feet. Right under mom. Hi. 
Yeah, um, to, to let him go outside with Dottie during the day. And we've been watching like hawks, but Dottie has been watching and they were corralling him in. Dottie and Honey were corralling him in, making sure everything was okay. All right, yeah, I know, I know. Back up, sister. But there he is, he's doing good. Things are great with him. He was out there in the field just enjoying the day. He'd take little naps and mom would take care of him. And as you can see, things are getting a lot better. So you, sir, oh, don't look at that. That's poop. That's it. You don't want to. Oh, there is life popping up everywhere. There is. Look at this little mama. Let's see her face, mom. Hi. There's Jet. Mm -hmm. She just had babies. She did. She had two little babies. There's one right There's there one. and one right there. It's a good kitty. Both of those little kittens do happen to be spoken for. Mm -hmm. So you folks out there, you're going to have to find Can't another source. Any. And then, sorry, mama. But you are going to get spay. Yes. But look at those cuties. It's okay, honey. It's okay. She's doing all right? She's doing fine. No problems. <laughs> no. She had two. Did. That's what we see. There might be more. Never know. There are more in there? I don't think so. I see the look one. Look at that one. Oh, bright eyes. Oh, tiger. No, they don't have their eyes open yet. Well, it looked like something. Day 10 is about when they open, our, open their eyes. Well, got sharp claws though. Look at that. It's okay, Mama. I'm not messing with your kitties. Mm -hmm. She didn't have them in this thing. Either. No, she had them on a bin. I don't know where Grace said she had them. Oh, here. Yeah, that's all right. right so we'll clean that out later. It's not dirty. It's actually <laughs> clean. <laughs> so Sweet new life thing. popping up all over. Mm -hmm. Two kittens that we know of. Yeah. Two that are spoken Two for. That, yeah. So. But after mama time, plenty of mama time. Of course, we won't take them from her. Not for a while. <laughs> How adorable is that? <laughs> I think we got her, honey. Oh, look at that one. Yeah. Mom, don't be so concerned. It's okay. <laughs> she is concerned. She is. Yeah. mine. Look. Kitties. This one's like tiger stripes. Look at that. Look at that. Let's see if we can focus better. Yeah, look. See? And look at his legs. There's only two. Dinner time. Dinner time for the sheepies. Hi, guys. And you. Time for the milk. There you go. All right. So your process goes as follows. Well, I normally just dump it in, but you said you wanted a hand feed on. Oh, you can go ahead and feed them. Oh, okay. Yeah, I was just going to film what you, what you normally do in the evening. Yeah. You give them a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Hi. Whoa. Chill. <clears throat> He's laughing at you over there. So these guys get separate food from the goat because the goat gets... Her minerals. She has different minerals than the sheep do. Yep, the sheep would get sick. Yeah. But, so now it's time for the milking. You guys got this down to a science. And he was laughing at you over there. I think it's sad. I really do hope. He was he was straight up belly laughing at you. No, he just wants his dinner. Oh, he wants his dinner. Yeah, so his is not quite ready yet. You gotta wait, pal. Look at these guys, they're munching down. It's the... Uh, it's the OK Corral, or Golden Corral, depending on which part of the state you live in. So, now Petunia, she's been doing really good as long as there's food. Look at that face. Look at that mineral-soaked face. You just clean her off. She's got all her tools here to make sure everything's clean. Yep. And dried. And 
and you're ready to rock. How long do you think it takes you? Um, only like five to ten minutes. Okay. You'll be able to build up some guitar player's hands. Strength. Or piano. Piano. Hey. She says, no. Nope. Bad girl. Oh, I'm distracting you here. Gross. I'll go play with the sheep. You do your thing. Hi, sheep. Alrighty, so lots to share almost every day. Um, yeah, lots of stuff we got, we've gotten done so far this week, and it's only Wednesday. Well, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, one day was shot with doctor stuff. But yeah. So what was your favorite thing today? What was your favorite thing today? Down in the oh, comments. I got stuff replanted, repotted. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that reminds it's me. It's been needing to be done for months, and... Well, I got the towers set up, but mm -hmm. um, I forgot. We have an update on a garden, but I guess I can wait till another video. Oh, there you go. I even got uh, the drone up and flying around. Mm, so cool. That was the sound it makes too, honey. Mm, okay. Just like that. Pretty good. She's been listening. So anyway, <laughs> please go over to our Homestead Health and subscribe even if you don't plan on watching it the reason why is it takes a long time to get the youtube algorithm to do anything so people that actually do want to watch it might not be able to see it unless there's enough people over there right so right that said yep what'd you say no that said well, <laughs> goodbye have a blessed and amazing day or um, an amazing and blessed day or which what's the order a blamazing day a blamazing day there we go